Hi, this is Peter with HTP America. Today we're talking about the new Invitec 251. Topic of today is dynamic power. This feature enables you to vary your amperage by holding the torch closer or further to the metal without the need of any foot pedal or any uh, slider or any other amperage regulating thing. This can be done with foot pedal, this can be just done with lift arc too, where you don't need anything, you can be on top of a ladder, just strike an arc, lift arc, vary your amperage, and then extinguish the arc without any accessories needed. So let's dive into it, I'll show you how to set this up. So the way how this works is, you take your torch, you can initiate an arc with a foot pedal or even just lift start, touch it, lift it off, arc initiates, the further you go away, the lower your amperage is, the closer you go, the higher your amperage is. And even when you're further away, the arc does not swirl around, it keeps it nice and, and precise and centered and stable. So the way how you access this feature is, you go into um, TIG 2T, Sure. Then you pick your process, DC, you go to dynamic power and you can say lift pipe smart. So lift pipe smart is, it allows you to use a standard tick torch without a valve and the moment that you touch the machine recognizes, starts the pre-flow, starts to flow gas and then if you lift it you can weld, very easy. You, if you're up on a ladder, if you're new, if you can't control your hands and feet all at the same time, it's a very easy process to learn. And then here, you see that your electrode is already hot. Here is your amperage. You can adjust your amperage. You put this in a certain range. And then you can determine how effective your dynamic power how much do you really gonna see an increase and decrease as you move it? You can adjust this right here. Dynamic power size, one amp per volt, and you can all go all the way up to 25 amp per volt. So now, as you go up and down with the torch, it will as you go down, increase your amperage. As you go away, decrease your amperage. And this is how you can vary your power welding without having to utilize a foot pedal or any other control, remote control, to adjust your welding amperage. So to weld, just hit the home button, your electrode is hot, touch it, and go. So here we have two plates, cold rolled steel shear cut edge clean that is already MIG welded on one side on the back side there's really nothing there what we're going to do is we're going to fusion weld this joint now using the dc process and we're going to use the invertic 251 with this new dynamic power function i will lift start the arc and i will show you how it varies the amperage where we have areas where there is no puddle forming actually because I hold the torch further and other areas where it's joining the metal like we want it to do. So our process will be 2T. We're gonna go to DC and we're gonna go to dynamic power. We choose lift pipe smart and we're gonna pick an amperage of 70 for eighth inch material this or 80 for eighth inch material this is a pretty uh, low amperage but you will see that with the um, dynamic power which is right here go into the setup let's take our um, post flow down to something reasonable 10 or 12 seconds maybe we were just welding titanium so we had excessive post flow um, the pre-flow should come down or oh, the pre-flow is determined by how you hold the torch to the material so it's not adjustable in this case anyways and then here in the settings button you can adjust your sensitivity of your dynamic arc from 1 amps per volt 
all the way up to 25. So the biggest changes in arc you're gonna see on 25, that's where my demonstration is gonna be. And now we are ready to weld. Okay, I'm touching the tungsten. Lift, there's my arc. So as you can tell right here, there is no melting going on. As I go closer, everything melts real nice. And I can weld at a fast pace. I can go up a little bit, weld at a slower pace. Or I can go high enough where there is just no, no melting whatsoever going on at all. As I go in closer, puddle forms right away. Puddle stops right there. So as you're up on a ladder or you have no option to operate a foot pedal, you can ignite your arc and exterminate your arc with the lift pipe smart function and the dynamic power gives you a way to control your arc as you're welding just by how close or how far you hold the torch to the material. Thank you for watching. This was our demonstration on dynamic power.